Hi everyone and welcome to Web Trends, where we interview local vendors to help you, the bride, find out what to look for when shopping for your special day. Now I'd like to introduce you to our next guest. Hi, my name is Mike Karavakis, owner of the DJ Connection, and it's a full service DJ company that I've had since uh, and running since 1981. I think what sets me apart from other DJs in this area is that you're talking to the owner of the DJ Connection. I'm the owner, I'm going to be doing your wedding. As compared to maybe other DJ companies that may have a few different people that they have working for them, when you interview me for your wedding or potential whatever party you have, you're talking to the owner that's actually going to be playing the music also. So I, I, I'm a good listener, analyze everything that you're looking for based on what your, what your needs are, and I try to adhere to that musically on what you're looking for to meet all your, to meet all your expectations. Actually, a lot of the younger brides right now are all over the place. They're looking at some of the older music, not, I don't want to say just oldies, but they're actually looking, brides today are looking for a good variety of music, and sometimes they're not aware of some of the older music that people like I, myself, have grown up with. So I give them some suggestions. Uh, thank goodness we have things like the internet to have them go through to find different types of songs or ideas through a lot of different websites. But when it comes down to it, they kind of listen to me they, they take some ideas from me also because I give them some good recommendations based on all the weddings that I've done. And they put that together with what they think might work and we come up with a good common ground of music between what, what they suggest and what I suggest. A, a bride today looking for a DJ should kind of ask certain questions like how long they've been in the business. To me that's very important. A seasoned DJ who's been around a while might have uh, more knowledge of, of different things, different situations. Not just the music, but how to apply music at a certain time at a, at a function, rather, rather than being a, a new DJ that's maybe learning the business. Uh, I just think it's important that, uh, that they, they know, is the DJ local? If it's a local DJ working at a local, uh, a local uh, reception hall, do they know the reception hall? I like to check out every hall that I go to, even if I've not been there before, to look at the whole acoustic situation, setups and all that. So I'm very conscientious about that. So they should see that the, the, the DJ they interview is, is very conscientious on what they're doing and how they're going to go uh, uh, approach a, their special day. I've been doing this since 1981 and wedding since 83. And I guess the most significant day I had was uh, I did a wedding for uh, somebody from a, lo from a local television station, actually NBC Studios. And Bob Costas was the, was the best man. And Seeing Bob Casas, they're throwing him literally up in the air and having fun with him. I, I thought that was kind of special because you look at Bob Casas as a professional sports person on TV and yet he's letting loose at, at something like this. Uh, it was like, my gosh, I'm looking at Bob Casas getting thrown up in the air and having fun here at the wedding. So that was a highlight of my day. I made Bob Casas happy and uh, he let loose a little bit and had fun at the reception that he was the best man at. Thank you for your time and thank you so much for being a part of Wet Trends. Be sure to take a few moments and click around our website and see some of the outstanding vendors that can help you plan for your special day. Be sure to check back next month for the next edition of Web Trends.